the event that we're putting on here today is for our seventh grade MATS teams. MATS stands for Mentoring and Thunder Success and it is our advisory and mentoring period. We're celebrating the fact that they have had zero cell phone referrals since the first day of school. So a referral is anytime a student is caught with their cell phone out or AirPods or messing with their smart watches. Really, all three kind of encompass that policy. As part of the policy, students can have their phones before school, after school, during passing periods, and at lunch. If when they're in class, they're not following the policy, they're issued a ticket. The teacher never touches a student's cell phone, and the student will take their phone and that ticket down to the office, and that is what they will use to pick their phone back up at the end of the period or the end of the day. So the community and students were a huge part of us putting this policy in place. The community reached out with resources and reasons why they would like to see cell phone policy in place. I went to our student government. I took it to the PTA. We took a draft to community council. They were 100% all in. I thought it'd be really helpful, not just like intellectually, but socially, because like a lot of kids will turn to their phones and this has like turned into lots of relationships and friendships and people have just like connected more this year. I think that it's helped me a lot with focusing in class and I think that it's helping me with my grades and I think that the teachers also is helping them and I think a lot of people are learning better now and getting better grades. Well, I like the cell phone policy because I think it helps kids get a lot more focused, especially me, and it's just been pretty beneficial because there's no distractions in school and no distractions in class. We're proud of how well they've done all three grades. We have been so incredibly pleased with how successful it's been. The teachers report that the students are far more engaged than they've ever had before. We're super excited to see what the academics look like at the end of first semester and then the end of the year, and we're pretty optimistic.